My name is Mike Haynes. I'm a respiratory therapist, and I'm here today to talk about what a spirometry test is and the basic procedure. So spirometry is uh, a test that tests a patient, um, particularly with lung disease, their ability to take a big breath in followed by a big breath out. So why should somebody have a spirometry test? Well, spirometry is useful in the diagnosis of a disease called COPD. COPD is a, a chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, which is primarily emphysema and chronic bronchitis. So in order to diagnose that, we, we do a test called spirometry, which tests a patient's ability to expel air out. With COPD, people, particularly emphysema and chronic bronchitis, they may not have the ability to expel air due to the disease process that's involved with, the, with emphysema and chronic bronchitis. People with lung disease sometimes have air trapping, which is a, when your alveoli has the inability to expel air as we normally do during exhalation. To actually do spirometry, it's a simple matter of breathing and being coached on how to, to do certain breathing exercises. The, the, the first part of it is, is sitting back and comfortable in a chair, um, taking a few breaths in and out. And when coached, you're going to take a large breath in, such as this, followed by a large expiratory effort like this. Um, it's, it's simple, but it, it takes coordination and coaching to do it. So the device we use is called a spirometer. It's, it's portable, typically. Um, what the patient does, we, we use a mouthpiece that the patient is going to put in their mouth, uh, all the way in their mouth with their, with their lips and teeth on the mouthpiece, being careful not to put their tongue inside of the mouthpiece. We collect the, some simple data, including their age, um, their, their height typically, and based on this data we get a predictive value of what their lung capacity should be. So once the patient's information is input into the device, the patient will take a big deep breath in, and when they're ready they're going to stick their tongue out and the device goes all the way in their mouth with their lips and teeth around the mouthpiece. And then when all the air that they can breathe in has been achieved, they're going to breathe out hard and as fast as they can for as long as they can. Spirometry test is done several times to obtain the most accurate results. Spirometry is important in the diagnosis of COPD and also in the monitoring of the progression of COPD. So in conclusion, spirometry is a very basic test. It's very beneficial for those that have COPD, including chronic bronchitis and emphysema, and it's also a, a very good test for those that may suspect they have COPD. Uh, spirometry may uh, be performed in your local doctor's office by contacting your health care provider.